four concepts that are very important. Right? The first one is the most important. If you can avoid things, you don't have to escape, deny, or attack back. <coughs> so this morning, I want to talk mostly about how you can avoid things. And often, people say, well, that's just common sense. And I say, you're right. But common sense is not commonly practiced. <laughs> and here's an example. Two weeks ago, I was coming back from Florida, where I was teaching at the Korean Martial Art Festival. Everybody here has been in airports, so you're sort of familiar with airport bathrooms. This is the bathroom I walked into. You walk in, there's a wall right here, so you sort of got a jimmy to the left, and then there's a long wall here that you walk around, and then after you go down the other side, there's the roll of urinals and the stalls and the sinks over here. So I'm walking in behind the guy. I walk in, he stops and he leaves his bag right there, the roll of the carry-on that he's pulling behind him, and he just leaves it. And then he walks down here around the corner to go to the urinals. And I'm like, hmm, good safety thing for my uh, website. I get my video camera that I always carry out of my backpack, and I film the bag, and I scroll down here, and I film how long the wall is so I can describe it. I get a funny look by a guy coming in. Who's this guy <laughs> videoing in the men's bathroom? So I put the camera away. Comparative analysis. But he still has not come back around. Now, Taking that camera out, filming his bag, filming the wall, putting the camera away, took a lot longer than walking up to the bag, grabbing the handle, walking out. Right next door was the family restroom. Go right into the family restroom, go into the back, close the stall. You got all the privacy and time you want to go through that carry-on. That was one of four or five bags that I could have easily stolen that day coming back from Florida. Now, do you think if I would have searched those four or five bags that I could have found a few items, maybe a laptop, a couple of iPads that would have more than paid for that plane ticket? You think criminals might think about that stuff? They do 